Yo, what is up guys? It's Bankrupt Dope, back with another video, and today we're playing Genshin Impact's Big Sister. Nah, I'm just like it. This is Honkai Impact 3rd, right here. Well, the third revolution, I forget the, the variant, but whatever. I love this game. This is the game that I think uh, Genshin Impact should be, but it's not. I feel like, I don't know, man. I have a very, like, I don't like Genshin Impact, you know, can I say that, it's not a bad game, I'm just joking, I'm sorry, this is, this is what, I'm joking, but like, I am, I just don't like Genshin Impact, and I think it's because I played this, you know, I played this game when it first released, you know, the pre-register and everything, the way this game was set up, when Genshin Impact came out, I felt like that was, it was backwards, you know, the lack of characters, the limited amount of freaking crystals you get, the hard grinding, but like, I get it. I know why it's that way. It's supposed to be an adventure game, right? But it can't be. It's a gotcha game, you know? So like, I always found it strange how some, you know, YouTuber stuff see Genshin Impact for what it's not. And like, you know, you can be free to play in a game, obviously, because it's supposed to be an adventure game. But like, it's a gotcha game, bro. You want to get the new character, right? And I like I hear some, I hear enough people promote that game and try to say you could just go free to play. You don't need to get the new and shiny character. That defeats the whole purpose of the gotcha. The entire purpose of the gotcha is to really get the new and shiny characters in you. And I find it really crazy to tell people in the Genshin Impact world. Just be free to play. Like you don't miss it. Of course you don't need it. Nobody. Of course you need the new thing to any of game. But you will. And guess what? In this game, I get to get what I want. That's why I freaking love this game so much. Now, this was a lengthy intro, but like as you can see, I'm level 28. I still have my old name up there. I probably should change that. But I, I like I like I said, I freaking love, I love this game right here I, th I think this is one of the games that does it right the combat in this game is immaculate bro like, I'm about to go into a mission I'm just claiming some stuff but like right here the Val oof I've never been able I, I, I never actually said the word out loud, out loud. Valkyra Valkyra I don't know how to say that I've, I've, I've just not I've, I've never said that word out loud but the characters in this game, there are a lot of them. A lot of them are just repeats of each other, like you see different outfits and stuff. But I'm fine with it because they try, they, they really make these characters have like, different attacks and stuff, which I do appreciate. But as you can see, these are the characters I do have, the ones that are in front here. I don't have a lot because I play this game on and off, unfortunately, due to space. There was a lot of times like when I had my old phone that hit me with the you're out of space. Which is just really frustrating because that, that that's really what it came down to most of the time. Actually, go ahead and enhance that. But uh Yeah. And then you got the supply over here, which I still barely understand to this day. So like I said, I've never took the full time to, you know learn it but like for this one here you get an a rank or higher guarantee when i summon on this one which is nice i like that and these are the a characters i believe i can get i'm not sure if there's like there's probably more in there but these are the features these a feature and then this is the s character here not too cool no, that's the class that is not her name what her name it's somewhere right in my face, isn't it? And I'm just blind. Or is that her name? Okay, yeah, so her name is for okay. It had me confused with all like class and money. I'm like, huh? Oh, that that's what those words that like, really mean, isn't it? Oh, whatever. But uh this is a new person for me. I don't know who the freak this is. I've never seen this character before or this model. So that would be cool to get, but we can't get it today. Today we're just gonna go and you know. We're gonna go attack. We're not gonna do any cutscenes. 
because that'll just take too long. I just want to show you the combat. And they do have an open world. I forgot all about that. They sure do have an open world in here that they added. That was not in the game initially, but they added it to the game. Let's go ahead and hit up this mission right here. I just want to show y'all just the freaking combat. Like, the combat in this game is great, in my opinion. Um, we're not going to waste that. Like, I love this game. I really do. I don't play it as often because you know I, I play Doug Metal, I play My Hero, I play Vanguard. So when I have all those games that I'm playing, that's why I don't play it. Go ahead and start off with this kid. This is my. Well, a bad way of saying this is my fast so you know, fast. You have this little orange orb that I picked up. That right there fuels my. Um, that fuels my. Abilities. I'm gonna turn the sound down because it seems like that's really loud. So I'm gonna turn it down just a little bit. But that fuels like my little SQ bar down there. That's a speed shot 150. That allows me to do my abilities. Like, for example, if I hit this button here, there's a, there's a flurry of attacks like that. And that's what hurt that button does. You know, pick up another one. I saw her ultimate in the moment when I get enough points to do it. Actually, I don't have advantage over these characters, but they're still pretty weak, so. But they're fast and weak. The person that has advantage over these characters, I believe, is her, right? Yep. And this girl, she shoots rockets. She charges up. Turn it up and blast them. Yeah, let him just peel over. But yeah, she just bodies people with rocks. I don't think she has advantage on these guys. Down. This girl has advantage up on these guys. And she has a great sword. So slow, heavy attacks that do a lot of damage. You know, her attack has spins down a lightning bolt on the head. Bop. And bop. And he's dead. Oh, wait. You're not dead. Why aren't you down? There we go. You're down, so it might be on you. What? Is my whole team... Okay, yeah, I don't have any type of money to this The thing about her is when she switches in, she lifts the person in the air that she um, switches in front of and then causes them to float. I freaking love it. Yeah, he's getting a little too close to the front. Alright, look him out the way. Alright, now it's boss battle time. So I'm gonna use all my ultimates just so you can see what they're working with. And my teammate joined the battle and he might kill these people in a couple seconds. But like, the ultimate sends out a robot. And, they assist, and I think the thing's already dead. That's crazy. So that boss is melted. I didn't know if this boss died that fast. I kind of knew the boss was gonna die that fast, but I thought about the teammate that I brought. Yeah, that was like an instant melt. So we're gonna go into another mission. So I have the other two character ults there, like their little ultimates. It's not a cutscene kind of ultimate, but it's like more of a power up ultimate. We're gonna bring a normal person this time for this one. That way, the, it doesn't just do all the work for me. The yeah, ultimates in this game are very normal. You're just like a power boost or anything of the sort. And this is just them talking. We'll speed through this because it won't make any sense if you've never seen this before. Okay, we're down. Um, no, you work. And then dodging on the game also does three times. Now her ultimate, for example, out. it gives her, makes her sword long. So now I can hit more than what she's directly in front of me. And it lasts for as long as that bar goes, and now it is over. I love her ultimate. It's the most 
she has the power of more simple ultimate, but it's very, very useful. And this is it, right? Ah, well, I don't have advantage of these people. But what it does is this freezes everybody inside the bubble and put I think it's like, probably one of the most useful ultimates in the game. Short, but effective. Now that we've seen all the ultimates, we're the person that has advantage. And this is like the only character that you can't, like, you can't tap. You got you do really anything you gotta hold. I mean, the person has to shoot up, they die, everything, you can't hit them. And specifically, this character dies. Now I can go for the kill. Oh, well, she still died. There we go. Now who's next? Let's get work. Over here. But like, this person's ability right here, she probably has the strongest ultimate, if you ask me. Because she summons like a robot that fights. That fights for you. But at the same time where I can just hold I literally just hold the button down and just release a massive energy wave that just embodies everything in front of me. Oh, I'm running out of time. Okay, now watch how this boss is about to get melted. I if I can beat him. Oh no, of course I'm down on the pretty strong character. We can still melt. We can still melt. Like, come on. It's, 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 it's not. Okay, and we're back. I kid you not. Right in the middle of that, I ran out of stories again because this is a story of my life, bro. We're always running out of stories around here. But we failed to beat this. Stage. We didn't miss anything. We're back right back where we started. And we killed it just like freaking five seconds off the timer. Kind of hard. But it is what it is. But yeah. This is. I like this game. That's all I can really say. I do enjoy this game. And there are so many more new dodges that are about to come out. So like, I really want to know, like, what should I cover? Because I want to do more than my hero, obviously. That's why I keep sprinkling in these random games at random times as I do. But like, look as much as I love my heroes, and I love the game, it's hard to make content on that every day when I'm not max level yet. So, I, cause I can't get out the guy, I can't get out any guys. I'm pretty sure those have all been made, and you know I'm just behind everyone. So it's it's a lot. It's very difficult for me to do anything original on that game. Of course, I'm going to continue to drop it, but like, on the off days when there's no events, I can't do the super hard stuff. Not yet, anyway. But I can't do that because I'm still grinding. Still trying to get my level up. But you don't get there. But I need something to post in the off days rather than, you know, me just not posting. I would like to post something. So I'm posting this today. I didn't get anything out yesterday. But, like, for example, today I'm getting this out. I'm kind of that. I love this game. It's cool. You know, if you guys don't like it, obviously you won't do it. But there's still a couple other, couple other games that are about to come out this month and next month. We'll try those out too. You just gotta let me know how you're feeling. You let me know how you're feeling by liking, commenting, and subscribing. So if this video gets like two views, it probably won't come back. So yeah, that's Honkai Impact. Check it out if you like it. I think the game's pretty cool in my opinion. And no, it's sure it's not free roam, but most gotcha games aren't. And it's a good game, in my opinion. So, check it out if you want. Go ahead and like, comment on my message, and subscribe. And I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.